Hey, Thank which you. one of you is Wes? Yeah. Oh, you're the new guy. I'm the new guy. <laughs> Come with me. Let's go on a tour. I've got right. some questions All for right. you. Be nice to him. Or not. Be like them. <laughs> so, Wes, when was your first day? It was Monday the 8th. Okay. How has it been going with Crisco and Dez? Eh. Is that an answer? Eh. Great. <laughs> which, uh, which one's your favorite? Uh, Crisco. Okay. How long have you known him? 20 so years. Great. Since you were two. Two, yeah. yeah. yeah uh -huh. Did Des greet you with a good morning this today? Uh, not today. Monday, Tuesday, Wednesday, yes. Not today. I can tell that she's over the niceness. What time did you have to be here this morning? So I normally been getting here at five, but today I came in at four because I couldn't sleep last night. And if I can't sleep, I come in and just play with things. So what I... time did you have to wake up this morning? I woke up at three because I just woke up before my alarm. <laughs> What's your favorite game? Uh, name that tune. Can you name this tune? You're a rich girl, ain't gone too far because you know it's only Metallica. Anyway. Nope. Holla Notes, Holla Notes. Everybody knows Holla Notes, Pidge. Are you, a, are you a member of Pidge Nation? Of course I am. Well, reluctantly, but of course I am. Okay, that's just me. Do you think you've got good odds for the three song showdown? I'm feeling like, uh, yeah, I have a really good odds today. Tomorrow. So, where Whatever are you day. from? Uh, originally from the east side of St. Paul. Do you like breakfast? Uh, only at night. I don't like it. I like lunch for breakfast and breakfast for lunch or dinner. What's your favorite local breakfast spot? This is such a hard question because I work in the morning, so I don't really get to get to go to breakfast spots. So I'm gonna use something generic like Perkins. <laughs> oh. All right, if it's your favorite, it's your favorite. What flavor of ice cream is most underrated? Uh, lactose intolerant. But yesterday when I went with Des and Crisco up to your level, uh, they had ice cream there and I said peppermint bonbon is in there. You guys have to eat that. And then I watched them eat it. What does a perfect day look like for Wes? I think go for some brunch and then have lunch at about 11 o'clock. Go have some lunch at about 2, get home, watch some HGTV around 5, and go to sleep at about 7.30. Speaking of TV, what's your favorite show right now? Favorite show right now, Yellowstone, although season 5 sucked. What show would you love to make a cameo in? Cameo in, I would say like Love It or List It on HGTV just because I don't know how these people afford million and a half dollar houses. Do you like movies? I do. What movie do you wish you could watch again for the first time? The new Top Gun. What movie can you quote by heart? Uh, let's go with old school. Okay, what can you quote from that movie? You're my boy, Blue! Where'd you grow up? Uh, east side of St. Paul. Went to St. Paul Harding High School. If you could go back in time and tell your younger self something, what would it be? Uh, don't be the little chubby guy because girls like little uh, better, not little chubby guy. Better shape, not little chubby guy. <laughs> What's your favorite memory? Ever? Ever. Ever would be when I hit my mom's car with a go-kart and broke both my legs. Who do you look up to the most? I'm gonna go with Des. I don't know why. <laughs> not physically. <laughs> what do you like to do outside of work? Uh, outside of work, I like to go to the gym, I like to go to my kids' sporting events, and I like to travel with my wife as much as possible. What's your favorite spot to have a staycation? Does Duluth count, even though it's like three hours away? We'll count it. Okay. It's Minnesota. What's your favorite place you've ever traveled to? Thailand, definitely. Ooh, if you could live anywhere in the world, where would that be? Santorini, Greece. Do you like to swim? I do. Lake or pool? I'm going to go with lake. Favorite lake? Phelan. Nice. Have you been purified in the lake? <laughs> I have not. Well, maybe. Probably. I mean, I was in high school and I was a little bit of a wild child. I bet I jumped naked into Phelan. Do you have any pets? Uh, I don't, but my wife has two cats. Children? I have three kids, a 22-year-old daughter and a 17 and 16-year... Oh, oh don't, don't tell them I did that. An 18 and 17-year-old son. What's your best dad joke? Um, what do you call a pile of kittens? I don't know. A mountain. <laughs> nice. How long have you worked in radio? 25, six years, something like that. If you didn't work in radio, what would your career be? I'd be working at Domino's as an area manager still. Does pineapple belong on pizza? Absolutely not. What's your favorite song right now? Favorite song right now, Justin Timberlake. Is it Jealous? Is that, a, is that the name of it? I should know that. Just, Justin Timberlake. Do you have a celebrity crush? Jared Leto. 
but only in 30 Seconds to Mars, not movie Jared, let alone outside of some of the movies. Coolest celebrity you've ever met? 50 Cent. And he let me wear his chain, which was $750,000, and I promptly handed it back to him because that's way too much money for me to have in my hands. What celebrity would you love to have coffee with? I'm going to go with Bill Clinton because I bet he has some amazing stories. What's your coffee order? I'm going to go with uh, black in the morning when I'm coming here for work because I just need the spike, but otherwise a, uh, just an a almond milk latte. Do you go to a lot of concerts? Uh, for work, probably more than uh, most people. What was your first concert? The Beach Boys at the Minnesota State Fair with my mom. I was like seven. And Kokomo was brand new, so that shows you how old I am. What's the best concert you've been to? I'm going to go with Fall Out Boy dash Zach Brown Band. I've been to a bunch of Zach Brown Band concerts. What artist have you seen the most live? That one would probably have to be the Goo Goo Dolls. What artist haven't you seen live that you would love to see live? Elton John. Ooh, are you a Swifty? Of course. Ever had a Juicy Lucy? Uh, Matt's. Nice. I'm sorry to everybody that doesn't think Matt's is the best. Is there any new Twin Cities restaurant that you're excited to try? Um, I went to Red Cow, um, but I heard the pizza at Red Rabbit is amazing. Favorite sport? Football, by far. Favorite team? Uh, the New York Giants. I'm sorry, Vikings fans. Have you been to any of the stadiums in the Twin Cities? All of them, but the U.S. Bank Stadium or the new Metrodome. What's your favorite stadium? Ever. Um, I'm going to go with where the Marlins play. I can't remember the name of the field, but it's in Miami, obviously. Um, they hit you the whole time with water because it's hot there. Did you ever go to the Metrodome? Of course I did. Twins, Vikings. I think I even might have played a football game in there myself. What's your go-to meal at a game? At a game, I'm going to go with you got to get hot dogs. If you're at a game, you eat hot dogs. Complete this sentence. Duck, duck. <sighs> Gray duck, reluctantly. Pop or soda? Soda. I was in Milwaukee for too long that now it's just in my head that it's soda. Hot dish or casserole? Hot dish. Do you have any tattoos? Uh, quite a few. What's your favorite? The one covering up my least favorite. <laughs> And it's not done yet, but I had barbed wire going around my arm and I'm cover in the process of covering it. Do you want more tattoos? They're addictive, so probably. Socks with sandals, yes or no? Um, if you're wearing slides, I think I just spat when I said something. How are you doing today? Uh, when you're wearing slides, I think you're fine with the socks. If you're wearing regular sandals, which I don't do, no socks. What's your favorite holiday? St. Patrick's Day, even though I'm not Irish. What's your favorite part about that holiday? Uh, that I feel like everybody's Irish that day. That's why I just like that you're embraced. What's the best gift you've ever received? Best gift? Love for my children. Oh, what's the best gift you've ever given? Love to my children. <laughs> <laughs> How many times have you crossed the Stone Arch Bridge? Never. Never? Never. All right. Do you have any useless talents? Not any that I could really share. Outside of, I think, like, if somebody's sad, they're going to cry. I, I get awkward in that moment, so I just try to make people laugh. So maybe that's one. I was going to ask you if you could show us your useless talent, but I don't feel like you don't feel, down and crying right yeah, now. Yeah, and I don't think you look sad to me. If you had a warning label, what would it say? Uh, careful, will say inappropriate things at any time. Do you have any irrational fears? I always think I'm going to get hit by cars, even though I have twice. And that was a long time ago. I always have to look twice, even on a one-way. What's your go-to dance move? Nailed it. What's the weirdest fact that you know? That a mule is a cross between a horse and a donkey, and it's also sterile. Have you ever been on TV? I have. I've been on American Idol a couple times, not as a singer, just as an interviewer. I've been on The Bachelor, same thing as an interviewer. And uh, that's the biggest ones I've ever been on. Do you have an on-screen appearance scheduled? Uh, tomorrow, today, when we're filming this, is Thursday, Friday morning, Twin Cities Live. You better tune in. Have you been to the State Fair? I think you already answered that question. I have been to the State Fair many a time. Okay, favorite food at the fair? I'm going to go with poncho dogs, which I know a lot of people are like, poncho dog, what's the difference? Pronto pup, poncho dog. They're different with the batter, and I go with poncho dogs, only because I did work at the State Fair selling poncho dogs. Nice. How do you feel about snow? I like snow, not cold. If you could name a snow plow, what would you name it? I'm going to go with beaker. 
<laughs> Love it. That's very appropriate. What do you set your thermostat to at winter? Uh, 68, always. Or 72. Depends. Depends on how cold I am that day. Somewhere in the... It'll be in those 68 to 72. Do you use social media? Of course I do. Where can we follow you? Uh, on Instagram, it's Wes McCain underscore. Otherwise, Facebook, just put in Wes McCain. And you'll find all of my pages. I've got a lot of them, I know. Are you Minnesota nice? Of course I am. Is this the strangest interview you've ever had? Uh, it's up there, but the strangest ever was me in a pile of pillows with Justin Bieber. His idea, not mine. And it did happen. And Rachel, our promotions girl, wants to hear more and more about it. So I'll have to tell her off camera. Was there a video of this? There was, but I, I'm going to have to reach out to somebody and get the video footage of it. I think we need to see that. Yeah, for sure. Well, thanks for this, Wes. I feel like I know you a little bit better in good ways and bad. Oh, thank you.